Mr. Scrubbolo. Yeah. How, how are you doing today, sir? I'm um, doing excellent. How about yourself? Lovely, thank you. Um, yeah, I'm sure you're wondering where my intrigue is coming from. Um, let me let me ask you this. Uh, out of all of your label mates, what experience do you remember the most? Like, which one do you remember dealing with more than the others? Okay, what is this for? Uh, purely intrigue in the one they call Shadowblade. Oh. <laughs> um, listen, man, with the one they call Shadowblade, yeah, yeah. you wouldn't want to know my opinion on him. Oh, believe you me, uh, I hold him in very, very low standing, the lowest of standings. Yeah, well, um, I can't find him. Okay, I can't find what profile he's in. Oh my I... god, well, well, Mr. Scrubbla, I've got great news for you. Uh, I have had very extensive dealings with him. Uh, he's threatened to murder me endless times. Like, I have had a real back and forth with this one guy. Uh, I'd be more than happy to relay it to you. Okay, um, well, number one, he is an ex-label mate. Yeah. He, uh, I don't know, man. He stole like ten of my songs. Jesus Christ! He he just steals everything, right? Yeah, yeah. And uh, last time I talked to him, we recorded, and then that name, number got, or that name got, you know. Yeah. Debated. Sure. So I mean, yeah, I'm. Whatever you want to know, I'm down. Oh, fuck yeah. Um, yeah, like, how, how long ago did you start working with him, and how long did you, have you known him? I've known him for close to maybe 10 years. Holy shit. Um, I've only known him for about a year and a half, and... Uh, and to be honest with you, in the beginning, I felt bad for the guy, and, you know, I had a little clout, and... He was trying to be a DJ, and I'm like, okay, man, well, I mean, I kind of feel bad for you. Of course, you've got some problems, and let's see what we can do. Yeah, I mean, I find it rather remarkable that somebody with his conditions can evoke such hatred, you know? Yeah, I, I, I don't, that's what I don't understand, and it's not towards just, you know, a stranger. Mm hmm the hatred is toward the people that try to help him. If you listen to my songs, you hear me shout out to Blade. Yeah. Yeah, he goes by Cyrax now. Yeah, that was the one for me. He's... Wow, so you started going by Cyrax and then he just stole the Cyrax name from you? I was going to release an album called The Cyrax Complex. Holy shit. Um... And he used to go by Virus, which was also stolen from me. Um, I remember seeing an old video. Uh, I seen it recently. Like, I've really dug deep in all this. Um, there's an instant where he threw his dog tags in the lake. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, what was, that all, <laughs> what was that all about? To be honest, um, he was with this crazy chick and... Uh, I don't know, they had drama, they thought they could make it better without me, and he thought his Lincoln Park cover songs were awesome, and whatever, and, uh... From what I recall, uh, would, would that woman be Heather? Yeah, yeah. Fascinating. Um, yeah, but, so, so sorry, I, I, my attention was diverted for a second, uh... No, you're good. Uh... Yeah, what got him to throw the dog tags in the lake again? Uh, well, he thought he could do better without me. So why would he throw them in the lake, though? Well, they were a symbol of the label. That makes sense. That's a stupid question. And he kind of got mad, threw them in the lake, and said, fuck you, and blah, 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 and then came back and apologized. And I would have made him 
go back in the lake and, and, and dig out the dog tags, you know? Oh, I told him to, but, uh... <laughs> yeah. Um, but, um, the song I'm looking for right now, it was stolen about a month ago. Unbelievable. Um, it was, um, if you hear the lyrics, the list, or, uh, when you see the red dot, we watch your body drop. Hmm. Me. Yeah, I, uh, I caught him in the song, The Life You Lead. He stole every lyric word for word from some generic songwriting website. It's just, it's unbelievable how much this guy steals. Man, I, uh... Um, can I call you back and yeah. finish this conversation? Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Okay, thank right, you. No problem.